So these are the sides of our lovely triangular park and we want to a point that is equidistant from each of them. So the same distance from this side as it is from this side as it is from that side. So you measure that distance straight at a perpendicular so this is congruent to that is congruent to that. And so how do we find that point? Well it's kind of cool. If you're the same distance from each one of those you uh, are the center of a circle uh, that's just tangent to each side of the triangle and that point is called the incenter and that incenter can be found it is the intersection of all the angle bisectors so bisecting a given angle so if you bisected each angle let me get rid of all this stuff so if you took this angle and cut it in half you took this angle and cut it in half, you took this angle and cut it in half. The point where they all meet is the in-center. It is the center of a circle uh, that is inscribed inside that triangle and the point in the center is equidistant from all the sides. So it's pretty cool. Um, I'm going to link you to a video after this uh, where I explain um, all sorts of other types of points of intersection, points of concurrency. Uh, there's neat things about the perpendicular bisectors where they meet uh, and where the altitudes meet. They all have fancy names and stuff. Uh, but this one they were looking for the in-center and which you can get by bisecting the angles. There you go.